Today, Andres and I, we have decided we are going to play some sports. We're gonna be playing tennis, throwing the ball, we're gonna be jumping, we're gonna be running, doing a lot of sports. But first, pero primero, you have to help me choosing my clothes. So, if I want to go and do some sports, what should I be wearing? I have my t-shirt and I have my shirt. Which one should I take for playing tennis? I think I'll go for this one. It's my t-shirt. Very good. I also have my shorts and I also have my trousers. Which one should I take? Shorts or trousers? I think I'll go for the shorts. So I take my shorts and leave the trousers on the side. And the last one. I have my trainers and I have my shoes. Which one should I take? Trainers or shoes? I think I go for the trainers. Very good, I leave it here. And I think we are ready for playing. So let's go. There are lots of football teams in the UK. Like Cambridge United, Aston Villa, Liverpool and Manchester United. This is Oxford United. These are the players. They keep fit. They can run. And they can kick the football. They can kick the football 10 metres. The football pitch is 100 metres long. They kick the football and run fast. What's your favourite sport? I can throw the hoop up to 7 metres. Look! What about you? How far can you kick the ball? Hey, boys and girls, hello! My favorite sport is football. And you know what, Ruben? I can kick the ball 10 meters. Are you ready? Let's go! Hello, guys. You know what? I can hit the ball up to 10 meters. Look at this. Today it's sports days and this is the egg and spoon race. I've got an egg and a spoon and I can run. Do you watch it? It's a sports day. This is the skipping rope race. I've got a skipping rope and I can skip. There we go. One, two, three, go. Today it's a sports day. This is the football race. I've got a football and I can kick the football. Come on. It's a sports day and this is the sack race. I've got a sack and I can jump. 
I'm the winner! Well, boys and girls, now you have to try to guess what number it is. I'm going to read and you have to listen carefully. Let's go! It's sports day! This is the sack race! I've got a sack! I can jump! I'm the winner! Hooray! And the correct answer is... Number four! Very good! Congrats! We continue. The next one is gonna be... Listen carefully. It's a sports day! This is the egg and a spoon race! I've got an egg and a spoon! And I can run! And the correct answer is number one! Very good! Continue! Listen carefully! It's sports day! This is the skipping race! I've got a skipping rope! I can skip! And the correct number is number three! Very good! And the last one is number two! It's sports day! This is the football race! I've got a football and I can kick the football! Very good, boys and girls! Goodbye! Singers, are you ready for the new song? Okay, so let's try to do the movements with your teacher Ruben. Come on, Ruben, get ready. And this is a new rock for you. You put your left arm up, your left arm down, left arm up, and you shake it all about. You do the hockey hockey and you turn around. That's what it's all about. Oh, the hokey cookie. Oh, the hokey cookie. Oh, the hokey cookie. This bent arms rise round, round, round. Let's try to do it again. Come on. You put your left arm up, your left arm down, left arm up, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey cookie and you turn around. That's what it's all about. for you! I'm hungry and I'm thirsty too. What can I eat? Hey guys, what are you doing in there? That's my fridge. Oh, why not? I can prepare a banana milkshake. Nice banana milk. Hey, 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 boys and girls, what are you doing inside my fridge? Oh my god, look at this, Piero. I wanted to eat something after all the day doing the sports. I have a question for you. I was thinking about cooking something after practicing sports. You want to join me? Oh, you want to come and sit with me? Okay. Okay, let's go! Come on, boys! What a surprise! Look, I'm thinking I'm going to get an egg. I will get some milk. I will get some honey and I will get some Wesley. Come, let's cook together. Okay, boys and girls, are you ready? I'm going to explain to you how to do a meal shake step by step. It's very, very easy. The only thing you need is just the fruit, in this case, banana, a milk. And, after that, a little bit of sugar. Okay, now that we are ready, 
the first thing we have to do is to wash our hands. Once we finish, we can stop. We are going to put three spoons of honey and we are going to put the bowl in the microwave and we pour it into the glass. Very good, there you go, our glass of milk. We're gonna pour it inside the pot. And we put the same amount of muesli into the glass. And we pour it inside. But the honey is ready, you can see. We pour it inside, we take the egg, and we break it. Okay, perfect. Keep all the mix inside. The egg, the muesli, the milk, and the honey is mixed up already, okay? I love dark sugar, but if you want, you can prepare with white sugar, okay? The only thing you need is a shaker machine. Step by step, you have to open the banana, Cut pieces. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15. And then we need a little bit of milk just to cover the banana, okay? Because it's going to be only a glass. And a few spoons of sugar. In this case, only two for me because I don't like so much sugar. This is a blender. <laughs> Once the mix is ready, it's time to use the frying pan. So we take it. Okay guys, now it's time to put the mix into the saucepan. Okay, so we're gonna pour it. And after that, we have to press the button. And voila! A healthy milkshake ready to eat and to drink. Mmm, mmm, I love it. You can put more or less depending how big or small you want the pancake. Let's cook it. Once the pancake is done, we can flip it over, all right? And it's ready. Y ya está lista, ¿vale, chicos? La sacamos al plato y aquí tenemos nuestra pancake. It's delicious. And after practicing this pot, you need to eat some fruit, some milk, why not? And try to be healthy always, every day. So, if you want, you can try at home, enjoy, have some time with your family, and be careful while you're cooking. Si queréis, podéis practicar en casa, hacer alguna receta parecida, pero siempre con mucho cuidado, ¿vale? Divertiros con vuestra familia, pero siempre con mucha seguridad. Un besito, chicos. Bye bye. Let's try to do the same thing at home. Goodbye and enjoy your milkshake of banana. Goodbye.